Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving the Microsoft Store Error Code 0x80073D05 when attempting to install or uninstall apps. So it will say that error deleting existing application data store failed. An error occurred while deleting the package's previously existing application data. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the start menu, type in a percent sign, and then local app data, and then another percent sign. Best match should come back with a file folder here. You want to just go ahead and left click on that. Now that we're here, you want to double click on the packages folder. So now you want to scroll down to whatever app you're having the problem with. So you can just go ahead and just scroll down here. Basically just locate whatever, again, whatever problem you're having with. So let's just say it's the, I mean it doesn't really matter for this tutorial, but let's just say it's the camera here. So I'm just going to expand that a little bit. And you want to go ahead and just select the folder, right click on it, and then select rename. You want to add a little underscore in front of whatever the name of this is so basically the shift and the minus key so again shift and the minus key at the same time get to a little underscore right in front hit enter and then once you're done with that close out of here open up the Microsoft Store and now you want to go select the three dotted icon near the top right corner of the store select downloads and updates and then go ahead and just select get updates so we should go ahead and start updating everything here and then once it's done I would suggest restarting your computer and hopefully that should have been able to resolve the problem you can also attempt to search for the app again in the Microsoft Store once you've restarted your computer again more specifically if it's a specific app you're having an issue with I don't want to go too far of any one app here because it's a very good chance you're having an issue with a different app but you could always attempt to reinstall the app just go into the store again once you this update has completed, restart your system, and then you can attempt to re-download the app as well. So just giving you guys another option to work with there. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.